Hi guys, welcome back. Myself, Logan Sama, joined by f -word. Again, we are going through top 16 right here at DreamHack Summer 2016, live from Yen Shiping in the middle of Sweden. What's going on? Are you, nice, are you well fed? Well uh, extremely, watered? Extremely well fed, yeah. Excellent well stuff. We're going to take a look at uh, the loser's bracket right now because we're going to update you guys. You can follow along on um, online with the stream uh, type, uh, I think it's exclamation mark bracket. You'll get a link to that. Um, if not, DreamHack Fighters, DH Fighters on Twitter have posted the links. Um, quick update, two-pack has been eliminated by Genius. Infectious has been eliminated by Gigi. They're going to face uh, each other in loser's bracket. Wow. Salty Kid faces Tokido in loser's bracket as well. Poppy eliminated Raiketsu. Yeah, saw that. Great play from Poppy. And as we said earlier, Momochi eliminated Zian. Let's get back to the action right now as Mago takes on Phenom. Karin versus Nikali. Phenom looking like really right confident right now in um, in winner's bracket. Yeah. He's doing really well today. So Phenom is like the most disrespectful European player out of everyone I've seen. He does not respect these guys for a second. You know, when he was battering the crap out of like guys like Takedo and, and uh, Itazan yesterday, it was just pure... Crazy disrespectful play, for example, um, and he make he really uses he really makes it count. But good start from Mago, not being phased by that disrespect. Lovely conversion. Oh, drops it, drops it. Not a full punish though. Gets thrown. Nice reset. Then on base out something. Just get, just get the overhead there. Oh, the range on that just a lot longer than Venom. Wake up, buttons. Oh my God, the guts. Oh, no, he, he didn't. Went for the low? He went for the low? You've got to be kidding me. Mago betting the farm on that. And the fact that he was willing to make such a gutsy read on that wake up just goes to show that there's a considerable amount of uh, respect here for Phenom. Wanted that over. Trying to bet out for it. Oh, Mago is the one making all the right reads at the moment. Nice interruption. interruption. Really nice. Solid round heavy mail. Wow. Dominant. One up already. Phenom's um relentless attack, attack, attack style. Not paying off on that occasion. I really like how Mago's identifying where the holes are as well, because like it's attack, attack, attack. And you could get blown up for trying to interrupt Phenom's attack at the wrong strings. Time. But he's picking the right options at the right times and really finding those holes, swinging it round. In his he's, had a, he's had a really, really good weekend, Phenom. Um, I think he comes into this game with a lot of confidence, but that victory there may have just, you know, slowed him down a bit. He needs to recompose himself, take his time, and get back into the zone. But fantastic adaptation there from uh, Mago, because I felt like Phenom was, was looking. You could tell by the way his, his body language of his character as he played and the approach. He was looking to steamroll Mago, but uh, Mago just shut that door very quickly. Ended up going the other way around. So Mago one up. Back to the character select screen. Phenom, I doubt, will go to his uh, former lover dictator. What? Okay. <laughs> All right, then. Interesting. He did say that he is willing to pull dictator out as and when needed. Wow. And we'll see how, how he gets on. It's just like when you've got the tools that Nikali has. It's just surprising. Go to a guy who gets Maybe he wants to just be able to slow down the pace fully with, with Bison. We'll see. It'll be a completely different approach to what we just saw. Got to be anti airing though if you're going to be picking this guy. Inviting that pressure is not a good idea. Oh wow, beautiful spacing on that stand fierce. Completely whiffed the oh, crouch medium. Whiff. Oh man, look at this. And this is where he really struggles. And this is going to be a perfect round. What a round for Mago. Didn't even have to use the meter in the end. Lord. Pick not looking so great right now. Match Definitely point not. Mago. Especially a forward dash, didn't get it. Nice view reversal at that point. Just kept, keeps the momentum in his favor. See, so just gets view reversal for fun, this character. How unfortunate. That situation that was looking so good for him has suddenly turned around, and Mago can close this out. Nice jab interruption he's going to have to activate here. I'm getting hit by that day one switch sides. Oh, almost. Wow. Oh, wow, that whiffed entirely. Oh, Base what about? Eight. He's back in it. Lovely play there from Phenom. <coughs> Using the invincibility oh, on that wow. dash. 
This pick suddenly that comes good. Really clever. Oh, nice well, that hit in front then went behind. There's that no cross up sign there. Horrible. Beautiful setup there from Finom. Going in now. Nice interruption. Again, the V reversal. Something that you really need to utilize against Dictator. He has really no answers for it. He's got. You see certain moves, you can react to the V reversal. It's a guaranteed V reversal. All that momentum's gone, but Phenom just re relying on his pure reactions there with that jab interruption. Looked like Phenom needed a round to warm up. He has been playing Nikali exclusively, I believe, from what I've seen. There's a slight life lead here. Yeah. That time it was weak enough to be safe. Unsafe, oh, well that punished. Was really unsafe. Oh man, he went for a throw and got walked backwards. He's got the super, he can't get opened up. Phenom too scared to press buttons, gets thrown. Next hit could win it for Mago. Again, that walk speed so good, just gets him out of that throw range. Oh, what a neutral jump! Oh. Bad decision from Mago, gets thoroughly punished. And Phenom's pick of Dictator has paid off. What a piece, Logan. Oh man. Just a perfectly timed neutral jump. Just why he did it, I do not know, but it was just a perfect time. Mago went for the shoulder. Completely whiffed. Going to the... Oh, had the opening there, didn't realize. Venom, I, I couldn't, I forgot I grew with you entirely. anti Aaron as well. He's now feeling the zone now with Dictator. Oh, wow, the random slides. He's so good at that. Saw him at Kaku oh, the momentum's all his right now. This dictator That's pit really paying off. Oh man, everything connected. Ooh. This is like a completely different Wow, game he is complete. Oh, lovely whiff punish though. Got underneath the devil's reverse. Chunk of damage and huge. Oh, back dash in the corner gets out of the throw. And it is set point now for Phenom. What a choice. This dictator pick has been a. A genius move in disguise. After getting perfected the first round, who would have predicted it would end up like this? It's not like nice. the matchup is any worse for, for Dictator than Nikali. It's just a case of how well he's been playing with Nikali all weekend. Put doubt in my mind, but I will never question the guy again. Looking good right now. Tried Great round. Logan, what a pick. Really clever play from Phenom and how he interrupted those strings. It was very reminiscent of what we saw Mago doing to him at the start of the game in the Nikali matchup. He looks so comfortable as well. He just looked really relaxed. What? After the first game. I mean, the first game. After the first it, round. Uh, first round, <laughs> yeah. he looks really, looks really troubled. I'm sure he was quite relaxed. He didn't really do anything in the yeah. first round. Um, Man, really impressive play there. Mago dropped into the loser's bracket. This is a guy who won TW Fighters just last week or the week before. Yeah, with a, an array of world-class talent at TW Fighters Unbelievably as well. Unbelievably difficult tournament to win. And he's just been sent to losers by one of Europe's finest. Well done, Phenom. Flying that Norwegian flag proudly. Phenom now has the honor of facing Daigo Umihara in oh, um, the that, semi-finals. That should, good. that should be good. That is going to be epic. Right now so we have So is that our first confirmed European top eight? Uh, yes, yes it is. So great, we're not giving all the Japanese, all Japanese top eight. We're not free. Come on. Come on, free. Europe. I've got good news as well. What's that? We've got a Europe versus Europe match coming up. Which oh, means we've got another European yes, guarantee yes. spot. Yay. High, high five. High five. Mm. Hey. Eat we're that. Not after, free. We're not free. After Stunfest, I really needed that. Thank you. Thank. Well done, guys. <laughs> well done, EU. <laughs> you flying those flags. But what an unfortunate draw here. Kongster. We'll have to play against Luffy. Luffy. I was just looking at, speaking of team kills, um, unfortunately, uh, Gigi had to eliminate Infectious in losers' know, bracket. I know, I know. And those two, for those of you who aren't here, those two literally from the same city have been training together, playing together, coaching each other all those weekend. Those two are the reason why they're both actually playing Street Fighter Five. So It's like such a heartbreaking thing when that has to happen. So Gigi, you know, will hopefully do his best to make sure that victory counts for something Round big one. as he goes on to take on Fight. who next? Uh... Uh, genius. genius. Having had to eliminate his good friend. 
I still uh, want to know what's happening with Salty Kid versus Tokido because I'm I'm kind of excited to see how he does there. Oh well, yeah, I'd like to see if we can squeeze in all of these matches on stream. What's the time now? No, <laughs> we're huh? meant to start top eight, like now. So no. <laughs> uh, anyway, next up we have got Kyung versus Luffy. It's an all French affair. Let's go, let's go. Now uh, Kyungster's been looking very comfortable today with his uh, cami. I said at the start of the tournament yesterday, I w I'm waiting to see Kyungster really peak at this game. I think this game is a game that he with his talent and his history should definitely be doing he's been doing good slightly better than he's been doing that and this could be the tournament where that happens he's had some really good runs so far in this tournament just sent Tompy no 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 slouch by the way into the losers bracket to, to book his place in this match versus um, Luffy so you know he's doing really well right now what's that actually losers is that mean Tompy's been eliminated this is winner's side this is winner's side right uh, yeah, this is winners. Winner side, Everything yeah. we're watching at the moment right now is uh, winners. We're trying to get every single game, and so far we have done every single game in the winners side for Top 32 on stream. Kongstar, um, for years, has done this build-up, Logan, to his matches. I remember playing with him in the 5v5 in the Canada Cup, and he does this this this, med this like meditation process he goes through where he takes his time, puts his face in his hands Kongstar. and really gets the zone. right now. And the stream reacts the same way every time. <laughs> <laughs> the face let's palm. get those face palm the emojis. Face palm Here let's, we go. Get, let's break a record, guys. Palm them faces up. Palm them faces, yo. Power up. That's right. Now coming out of it, Kyung. Luffy with his. Uh, I need one of those t shirts, man. Yeah. Show those. Do you know what's really nice? The off. Red Bull freaking hoodie, man. And you know what's even nicer? The Dream Hack hoodie, man. That I need I'm one of those. right now. No, no, not that one. That one's, that one, that one's okay, man. It's gas. The sick one with the zips on the. the I the went to the store, it sold out, it sold out. Oh. Sorry, you weren't buying one anyway, you cheap Oh, I might have been able to get a little, uh, shaman, uh, shaman, little, little friendly discount, eh? Button checks? Yeah, of course. Didn't the French know. are notorious for taking 800 years to do button checks yep. and everything else. Mm -hmm. And they're living up to that here again? That's right. <laughs> Holy crap. Look at that. K.O. Quite well, needs to get his, uh, he's dangling his cord. It's crazy that the extra speed of the command grab doesn't slow down when she gets that, that mode. It's the same speed, command grab. Just going through for a few button checks here. Like, looks like Kyung's having some stick adjustments as well while Luffy's just mucking about. Have these guys done traditionally against each other? Have they played recently? I haven't seen these two really. I've seen Luffy against uh, Tupac. Last time I saw that, Tupac won. I don't remember what happened last time uh, Luffy and um, Kyung played, but they've undoubtedly played. The French community is very active and they yeah. hold a, a lot of events themselves, like weeklies and and monthly like rambats and stuff like that stuff so that you don't really get to see because it's on sort of hitbox and yeah, daily some, motion some different, different and streams, you know uh, drawn in a flip book not many people Sold watching on VHS all, all these all these places that you're not going to see it but yeah they've got very active very community active, very active <coughs> so um these guys will have a better idea how these oh not again go. oh wow he just did that again what his face He's resetting the oh. meditation process. Please. <laughs> Come on, guys. Give me some face palms on the stream. I only see him one or two. Come on. Go with him. Go with him. All right. It was a short one that time. He's ready. He's ready. Yeah. There they come. Oh, that was a short one. <laughs> That's good. Hey, these guys are pumping them out. That's probably more than we did for the long one earlier. <clears throat> All right. Here we go. We have got Kyungster <laughs> player one, Luffy player two. Kami versus Armika. Kyungster opens the third gate up before the match. <laughs> Rock Lee style, ready to ready to go. I'll oh, drop me out, you weeb. Right, let's go. <coughs> what, what? Wow, that come on, grab grab from a mile away. I'm assuming it caught. Oh man, that's, that was still recovering. That was guaranteed. Horrible recovery on that. The cannon. reset. Oh, wow. oh, he baits the reversal out. That's the round. Stunned, dead. Great play there from Luffy. One reversal. Such a big deal with Cammy. That health bar is good. She has a cannon spike, but 
cannon strike, but when she gets hit from being baited, often she doesn't go on to win that round. That third gate needs to be closed, mate. I don't think it seems to be working. <laughs> Just warming up. No response to the drop kick. Interrupts with a crouch at medium. Carries to the corner again, just poking away. Luffy being very patient. One of the characters Mika can't bait with a. With a there it was. The splash, splash yep. because of the horizontal range of the DP. Yeah, you, you get, she'll get a trade though, which is still pretty worth it. Oh wow, Luffy with an execution error. Random command grab. That's a quick rise there on a throw. She's always quick rise on a throw from Kami. She has no meaty, no reason to give her one. Wake up buttons connects though. Back into the corner you go. It could be over. It could end here. It could he could literally lose oh, this RP oh, drop. It. Reset. One more oh, and it could stun. be the round. Gets out of the corner, chooses to sacrifice the stun for that. Oh my god, this round that was looking so good from Kilnster suddenly looking like Luffy could bring it back. Gets away with that drop kick. Tried to wow. forward dash. Well, there's no need to make that kind of read. Looking for the back dash, just do the straight stand light like kick. That's gonna hit the back dash to start up and keep him grounded anyway. I don't understand that. Luffy That's playing Street Fighter 4 for a second there. No invincibility in this game. And again, no reaction to the drop kick. Stay in front. Nice jump back tech there from Luffy. Gets out of the pressure. Is that ambiguous? Oh my god! What a cross up! Oh, a rare drop from Luffy. That's two now. Getting away with all these drop kicks though. Surely Kami doesn't have to take these. Not at all. Oh, oh the crouching medium punch tech to make the throw with. And now he makes the stand throw to a big punish. Oh, oh really that was important a cannon very connection. brave cannon spike. Oh, nice, nice cross cut as well. Oh, he missed it. That's going to cost him. Oh, and Dropped that, his instant cannon, Logan. That sent him to loser's bracket. That was way too many. Wasn't that? Yes, two. Was that two? That was the first game. Is that the first game? It's the first game. Wow. It's been a long day. Huh? <laughs> yeah, first sorry. Game. First game. It's been a long day. I've to be fair, the build-up was as long as like four, yes, four or five I, games. I, I just felt like these guys have been on stream for 20 minutes, and they probably have been, to be fair. 15-minute button check. <laughs> 10 minutes of meditation. Gates open. Oh, we predicted that. Oh, wow. Waste the whole Nadesco with a throw. So clever from Kyung. Not falling for any of these anti-air baits. Oh, you, sure. guys are, you guys are killing the Kyungster in the chat. <laughs> they still do the meditation. <laughs> They're giving quotes as well in between the meditation. It's terrible. What a round from Kyung. Strong round from Kyung. Maybe there was a little bit of a lag spike I on like that uh, gate opening. It seems to be open now. Eight frames later. I like that crouching medium punch. He's using that to interrupt a lot as well. Block string and then just backs off. Nice anti-air that time. Back medium this time. Such a great choice of anti-air in that angle. Well, the cannon would have probably whiffed. Nice neutral jump from Luffy though. Oh, I didn't get a full oh. conversion. Too greedy. Should have used the EX. Why is Kyung just letting him drop kick? Because he's good enough to do to react to it, so he's letting him do it, and I don't understand. Such a telegraph move. Luffy's playing a, this is probably the driest I've seen Luffy play for a long time mm. in this. With, with, they must with have me. a lot of player experience against each other then. Wow, and it's working really well. Kyung getting frustrated and walking into that clap. With the button at the wrong time. Now he's cornered. Oh, the Stanford came, but he didn't punish it. Plus after that forward fears. Kyung tries to press him. Wake up. Oh, the heavy kick. Unbelievable. What a round from Luffy. He now moves into match point. Final round. So that, that slow kind of like patient play. Really working for Luffy. Oh, poor slide though. This round has started really bad for him. Gets caught by that. Stays in front. Oh, badly timed. Didn't get the juggle right though. She was too high in the sky. Nice jump. He's done enough splashes yeah, to. And he uses like that to get some giant jump. swing. Huge damage. Buff damage on that as well. Yeah. 
loads of neutral drops. Just, oh, big That's mistake. Does punish. Wake up buttons connects though. Man, I love that. The and range all of the damage from. as well. Uh, maybe the EX for the kill for the extra damage. But let's go put some in blocks. Oh, oh walk up late button. For the hard punch. She's dead. Oh, Luffy, you beast. Delay after the dash go. Oh man! Crush counter, and that did a hunk of damage to her oh, frail oh. 900 hit health uh, body. Only, <laughs> only, only Kyung will know what he pressed there. But my goodness, it's a button he might not ever <laughs> press ever again in his life because that must have hurt. Oh, that hurt me well, that when he got jab hit by or that. I throw. felt that in Just, my chest. I, re I reeled back, yeah. I literally oh. reeled back. Like, Damn. Brutal. Fantastic read from Luffy. Takes it. And uh, Kyungster drops into the loser's bracket. Luffy doing what we thought he might do today. Marching on in winners so far. Well, the next against... match is going to decide okay. whether we are going to get the who is the greatest Armika match. In semis, ah. because it's Fudo against Haitani. I would be excited to see that, to be honest. I, I kind of would. Yeah. Like just in terms of the weight of it, you know. Luffy's doing so well. Fudo's really stepped up recently as well. I want to see. I want to see who's got the filthiest setups. I can't. I can't see. But um, there's one man. There's one man who's between them, and that's oh, Haitani. Yeah. Well, if a man's what you want to call him, more like a. Superhuman from outer space. Uh, the best uh, Nikali you're gonna see for some time to come uh, is standing between them. And he could, he could, he could very well make sure that we don't see that that mirror. That a lot of you weeaboos will be loving to see that mirror for all sorts of wrong reasons too. I'm rooting for Haitani as much as I love Fudo, just so I don't have to see that mirror match. So let's go Haitani. Yeah, that's that's that's, that's just where I stand. Let me like, send, uh, send like Haitani some of my energy to make sure he wins. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, five minutes time. We'll be ready for the uh, for the match. Don't do that on any planes again. I don't want to get thrown off. I kind of feel that, you know? I kind of feel the power. Yeah? Yeah. I feel like, you know, it's just... Wow. Kyung, that's a pretty interesting technique, you know? Say no more, boy. Channel that energy to Haitani. Kilks are still in, though. He's in a loser's bracket. He's got every chance of doing some damage from there on. But for now, we need to find out who's going to be playing Luffy. So Haitani, we're going up against Fudo. Some Japan on Japan crime. Trying to find uh, some records of where these guys have played recently in tournament. I, there's so many tournaments, I can't remember everything that's going on. So the one I watched that was streamed on Team Spooky, that was TW, right? Yeah, uh, yeah, from Taiwan. TW. And the, these guys are both in it. I just don't remember what happened to. I think Fudo. If you guys know in the chat, if uh, these guys have played recently, do let us know because I'm racking my brains, and I can't find the information on the line. I have to go and watch the whole stream back again, which I wouldn't mind doing, but now's not the time. Ain't got the time for that. We've got to get to top eight. This is the last match in at quarterfinals in winners. Let's see if any of you guys can uh, tell me how it goes between these two <laughs> in the stream chat. <laughs> Funny comments. All right, let's go. Fudo. V's high time. Fight. All right, here we go. Aggressive start from Fudo. Wow. That was completely intentional. Wake up, clap, anti air in the jumping. What? That didn't link either. Yeah, complete mistake. Nice combo. Good oh. backdash. 
Nice punish there for that. With the command grab. And all of the stun is gone. Oh! Just messed oh up my up. goodness, Haitani, please. Haitani has gone to the school of Kazunoko reversals right now. What a They're gutsy all working sequence. as well. Crazy. Let's reset in the corner. Corner very quickly here. Whoa, he teleported into his hands with that. And behind. One more for the stun. Nice V reversal. Just gives him a bit of breathing room. No anti here that time. Oh, and he just checked nice. him with that medium punch. He knew he wanted to get out of the corner. He just kept him in his place and linked him to the EX shooting Peach. Such good disciplinary treatment there. Just tell him to behave himself and stop moving. Further to the EX. Starting the next round in similar fashion. Wow, that medium just comes out of nowhere and clips him again. Oh, and he that time. It. Oh You're my, done. it's gonna be the this done. Be, I mean, he hasn't got a meter to kill. Yeah, 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 well, that's looking that way, but don't celebrate early. He who celebrates early, bye. I really liked, um, I really liked Fudo's corner control. He really dealt with that well. Gets the timing of his command grab right this time. <coughs> wow, Dash is into the stomp. No anti at that time. Got counter hit. That's ground pound. It's re reversal. And again, so much success with those wake up DPs. Oh, uh, and what a round from High Tiny. That was just rapid. Connected, Logan. Everything worked and it was all counter hits. Great play there from High Tiny. No significant punish on that Irish whip. People still not ready for that. Hard knockdown. Forward hard punch, there we go. Oh, oh. The buttons afterwards. Oh, oh he missed the punish. They both let each other off. Wow, Ooh, this is really more sloppy more than right now. One more touch for the... Oh, what a brave wake-up jab. One more touch for the stun, and he still woke up with jab. But that's it. Takes the round. Match point Fudo. Wow. Nice tip yes. the command grab. Oh man, it's the bus blast from full screen. How many is that? He's like six or seven, they've all hit. We don't get to hit by a lot of reverses I'm noticing. Nice activation. Oh no. Trying to save himself this match point at Hatani. That was a really interesting way of dealing with the Neshko. Oh man, no, he had it. No, stomp again. It's two times it's not cancelled into the stomp. With full critical art as well. Oh wow, wow. Straight, straight off the medium kick? Yeah. I don't think that was a confirm. I think he's committed to that. She's not dead though. Oh, wake up, jab into the done it off the stomp, out. she'd be dead. Oh, he oh. took to the air, he's deactivated. I think he might have activated a reaction to the jump even. And that is it. So you're right, Logan. It's going to be Fudo versus... Uh, <coughs> if he'd have done Crouching Medium Kick Stomp into Luffy. the critical art, that would have uh, that yeah, taken it. Yeah. Probably would have killed. So that closes out um, top 16. Yep. Up next, we have top 8. We're going to take a 30-minute break because I have not eaten at all today. And he's only human. 
He's at any human. point. Okay. So take it easy, guys. We need to take a break, all right? Um, we'll so we're going to be back in... <laughs> no, no. 30 minutes? 30 minutes? Uh, stay yeah. tuned. Don't disconnect and spread, Half this, an spread hour. this link. Half an hour from now. I'll eat faster than that anyway, so it's fine. We'll definitely, but we'll 100% be back in half an hour. I'll be back in this chair with Efford. 30 minutes, and we'll start running through top eight, out. and every single match from top eight will be right here on stream. Winners and losers, and the whole thing's first three out of five. Stream Hack Summer here 2016 premiere event. We'll find out who the next confirmed name is at the Capcom Pro Tour finals at the end of the year. But we'll be back in half an hour from now.